Hey guys, okay, it is that time of the month again. It is finished pages for the month of May. I'm gonna try to go through them as quickly as I can, um, but I do have a lot, so. I'm gonna start with my small books first. So the first one we have is the Winnie the Pooh, Art Therapy, Disney, Hatchet Heroes, all that business. It's one of their small square books. Sorry for the shaky camera. One of their square books. I did two pages. I did this one, which was done in Jane Davenport watercolor. And then the second one that I did was just with the Crayola Super Tips. So I did two in that book. Those are the first two pages that I've done in that book. Okay, my other small book is The Square Mandala's Happiness by the Belba Family. And I did this one page here and I did it with glitter gel pen. My um, Sue colors, but you're not gonna be able to really tell that on camera. So we did that one. Um, in Spectacular Spring Scenes, I did two. Um, I did this one first on my own, the very beginning of the month. And then I did this one as a body color with Amanda Downey. So that was two out of that book. <clears throat> um, out of this kid's magical unicorn um, book. This is from the Dollar Tree. Um, I just did this one and the unicorn is done in crayon and then we have glitter gel pens on the rainbow and the horn. So that was just a simple one. Okay, we have in Mystery Colors Animal Fun, I did the first page, which is the horse. So that is done in Crayola Twistable Pencils. Okay. Um, Color by Number Quest Circles by Kira Shershneva. I just started in the front of the book and I just went all out. This is actually the second page. So I just went from page to page. Um, I did all of these in water-based markers. Um, so the Creatology or the Super Tips. That one could be for my May. But I got this book in the beginning of the month and then I just kind of kept going. This one is a video on the channel, or part of it is. Tried this in all glitter gel pens. You're not gonna be able to tell. I did this guy and then this is a whip. That's coming on through, so. <clears throat> I did one in the Color Questopia Color by Number Highlight Reel. So this is the black background version. And I did this one, which is from the Beautiful Hummingbirds book. So that's the one and only that I did out of that. Mandala Black Background by Color Questopia. This one, again, is one of those I just went I did a bunch of pages in it. So I'm just gonna flip through them all. I started it with this one and then I just kinda kept going. Threw some gel pen at these also. So there is like some of this is marker and some of it's gel pen. Same for that one. I definitely think that this will be one of, this is all a gel pen, the next books that I finish. So, and we start there. All right, so I did one also in Spring Scenes, large print, um, color by number, black background, color Questopia again, and I did this one. I knew it would be quick to work up. There wasn't a background, so I was like, it'll be quick. 
100 Beautiful Mandalas by Camellia Angel Cova. This one I'm going in order. And so the next one I did was this one. All glitter gel pin like I do for most of these. Someone told me this one actually looks very Halloween. But, um, okay. So then I did um, Out of Mermaid Stained Glass Coloring Book by Sun Life Drawing. I did this girl. She does have some glitter on her where it was supposed to be black. I just threw glitter at it. And in Brain Boosting Coloring Designs, um, I did two different pages. I was on a pattern kick for some reason, you guys. So I did this pattern first, all glitter gel pin. And then I also did this one in all glitter gel pin. So I don't know what my pattern kick is about, but I enjoyed it. 50 Ocean Miniatures. I did two of these. I did this one as a buddy color with Misty. Um, I did use watercolor pencils um, and glitter gel pen and Spectrum Noir glitter pen also. So that was the buddy color with her. And then this one I just did on my own. Kind of don't, I should have went with a different color for the fish, but otherwise it's all glittery and I did those. The unicorn book, um, this is a color along. The whole book is with Lauren at Lauren Loves Color. Um, I only did one this month, so it would be this one. And the colors I picked were kind of off, like it. this is too close to the background color, but you know, it's all right, it, it happens. Um, we have the You Are Loved by Color Questopia, and I did this page. Again, another easy one because there was no background. So that, um, the Fashion Coloring Book by Color Questopia. I did this lady. Again, my colors were off, like her skin is too yellow. You know, there's some things that are off, but. Um, the Mickey Mouse Memories Coloring Book. This is one that I, is a bend-in book that I got from Dollar General. I did this one. So. All right, this is my um, book that I take everywhere with me. Um, so I did several pages in it. This is Mosaic Art Patterns by Such and Such Diva. So I did, I'm just going in order. I think I have nine pages left in this book. So. I just finished this one like yesterday and then we'll be on to the next. All right, so for my last few pages and my prized possessions, we have the um, Disney Babies Circle Magiques. I did this page with Chip. A lot of people liked him on Instagram, so I appreciate that. And then the other page I did in here is Squirt from Finding Nemo. So, all right. And then we have Le Grand Classiques, to Tome 4. So this is Volume 4. Um, I did this one. Um, in these pictures, I actually was, told my sister, I was like, pick. <laughs> and so, of course, she picks this one. It's super complicated. So that one of the Up House, and then I actually just finished this one yesterday as well, of Ariel. So I feel like that is all of my completed pages for the month. Um, I really hope that you guys enjoyed this, and I'm going to go ahead and get a start on to June's finished pages. So I hope that you guys loved it. Comment below with your favorite picture that I did. Um, that will be something different. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.